planner babe thank you so much for tuning into my channel if you're new here welcome if not then welcome back in today's video I am going to be planning in my teacher layout for the week of September 19th through the 23rd um, I pulled out this big size sticker book um, which was in the newest fall release from the happy planner and this one is called butterflies and blooms I'm really, really hoping they will come out with a classic size with this book because this is so gorgeous. So I also pulled out this Papillon sticker book as well because I may be able to bring in some of the butterflies in here. And then um, this essential quotes to see if there are any quotes that I might want to use. And then I'll just bring in a few functional boxes here and there. I pulled aside some washi because I'm, you know, trying to use up my washi. I do have a, a quite extensive um, collection, I guess you can call it, of washi. So I am trying to use them as much as possible. Um, yeah, so we're going to go ahead and get this planner plan with me started. I'm going to take my pages off the disc as I always like to do. Um... And then we're going to get into it. <clears throat> all right. So I am feeling a little bit better. Thank you guys for all the well wishes. Um, <clears throat> and so, yeah, trying to, just, you know, take care of myself and get a little bit better. So I was looking through the book and I think I wanted to either bring in like these florals and those probably probably gonna go with both of them i really like those so and then it's like a nice calm feel for my work planner um so i think that's what i'm gonna go with i love that they put these big washi strips in here that's kind of nice different nice different approach um i'm wondering if these will match. Let me see what else there is. I love these big books. It's like so quick and easy to plan with them. Oh, that is cute. I like how that goes. Okay. Let me see. Let me go back and look. That one. Will that go with that? Let's check out a little more. Okay, so let's go back. So I like that one. I like this white, but I did intend in my head to use some pink, some of the pink florals. That's why I pulled out this washi, so don't know how well that would go with pink. All right, so I did bring in this pink, so I don't think the pink would go with those. So let's take a look at the others. Don't know. Are these florals? Yeah, those are the same. Okay, so let's do something like that. And then I was just looking <clears throat> at my bigger washi. And I just purchased that from a little small shop called Emily. Emily something. Emily Stationery Hall. I think that's the name of the shop. I actually did a haul video for this one. So I think I do want to bring in some of this. So I'm going to cut this off. I've been like all the way into using a lot of like, um, like journaling stationery lately in my planner spreads. So, I think this is super cute. Let me move this out of the way. See what I want to do with this big washi. So, I think I'm going to pull like a little slip of it down. Down this section here. And then. there. Yep, let's do that. I 
won't be at work actually this Friday. I am going on a little weekend trip. So I've taken Friday off. So I really won't need the space anyway. So we're going to go ahead and just cover this bottom part here. I love that look. I want to bring in this other piece kind of like up here but I don't know if I want it that big or, should, or do I let's see I don't I know I don't want it like that it does fit all the way across so let's see let's do it like that save this because maybe I put maybe I can put that somewhere like up in here so this is gonna be cute I already feel it okay so let's get that one off I need to use this top part to straighten it out. Mm -mm. And then I may have to, yep, kind of cut that part off. And that's no problem. This white one in here in my box actually I mean, in my, in my planner bag that's cute I don't know let's see how that works out but I am gonna put this to the side because I might want to include that and I don't want to forget if I put it far away it, it may be like out of my out of my mind okay so I think I want to put this here actually that's actually kind of cute. Okay. So, let's see. All of the things I wanted to add are kind of back here. So, this one, I'm trying to find which one of these is going to match. Because then, I think this one would look nice. Because I can, like, layer that with something would be nice to find and you know what I think I can find another quote in a different book yeah in that quote book so let's just open up to this one only thing about this is these are transparent and these are paper so it's gonna make for an interesting dynamic Hmm. Do I want to do that? But I do. I like it a lot. Okay, so let me see. What? I pulled out these two 
Functional Boxes book from Mojo Jojo Plans to see like which boxes, which, because uh -uh. I did order this pink one and it has like so many different shades of pink. So, I don't know which one I'm going to go with. I probably want to bring in this dark one. I don't know. And then some of the, the lighter ones. Yeah. I think I want to do that. So, we're going to go with the light, light pink and the dark pink. So I don't think I'm gonna need that pastels book. I pulled that one out too. So let's see what we can do. All right, so I know that I need a bigger box because I like to put like a big box over on the side. And I don't think this book has the big boxes. Wait, let me see. Oh yes, it does. You know what? Oh yeah, this is a good size one. Where's the color though? Mm -mm, get it past it. There we go. Let's use this one. I like to put like all my to-dos over on this side here. So I think I'm gonna go ahead with that. Let's go with our light out. You know what? Let's, let's do the white out. And so we don't need the, the pen. So I'm going to need this one. Two. Okay. So I'll put that down. And then I need to lift this side back up so I can do the remainder of this vertical black line. So let's go ahead and do the rest of that. Okay, so that's that. And then, oh, what did I bring in that? And then, no, I don't want to do that yet. Okay, where can I put that? Let's do that there. <laughs> okay, let me see if this book has like any like labels that I might need. Or I may have to find one of my teacher books. <sighs> to kind of label the functional parts. No, that, oh, oh, that gold is not going to match. Oh, wait. I do have... That's a different pink, though. Let's do... See, is that going to match? No. Let's... No. Mm -hmm. All right, let me see. What do I have? Okay, so... I went and got the Groovy Teacher. Let's see what kind of pink, like functional things I might have in there. So let's see what we can find that will match. Because it does have like some pinks in here, but I don't know if it's going to be the right things. And it's looking like. It's a no. That's a no. Okay, so let's look at this big. This is called Wake Up and Teach. It's supposed to be like geared towards like um, homeschooling, but you can really use them for anything like teacher or mom. You can use this book still. So, two dates, reading, mm -hmm. 
those are silver. I don't want to bring in silver foil if I'm going to use that washi. So, notes. No, it's kind of dark. Okay, this one maybe I know. Nope, not what I need. Okay, now let's try the mint to teach. It's got some pinks in here. I don't know if it's going to be like too light of a pink, but it's more like a peach. All right, so we may have to, let's see, let's look at this pink here and the pink out of here. No, that's two different pinks. Yeah, no, that's not gonna work at all. No. <laughs> okay, so we're just gonna go with our boxes and what I'll have to do is I'll have to label it myself. Which is fine. We did say we're gonna do this one, right? I think so. Yeah. Alright, so let's see. No, because we wanna put it. So, I want to do maybe like a piece of this one over here. Yeah, that's gorgeous. Oh my god. Where's my phone? Exactly. This is like so gorgeous. I love this floral. Flower. Okay, so we'll do that there. And then the other piece will go somewhere on the other side of uh -oh, the other side of the spread, of course. Let's see. Maybe up here. Like on Monday and Tuesday. So let's see how this looks. All right, so okay. All right, so I'm gonna use my whiteout pen. too much like too much like I don't too much mind like the grayer boxes I mean boxes the grayer lines but the back black lines kind of they kind of bother me through the um, transparent stickers so okay so let's go with that for now and then I think I know I'm going to need a box over on this side, just determining what size. I think I want to use this size, and I'm going to do this one going this way. And then 
use some of this washi now. Let's bring in some of the washi here. Let's do this one. Man, I've had this one for so long. I don't even remember which, which, um, like, uh oh, like collection it came in. Put it right there with that one. Cute. Okay. That's nice. And then I think I'm going to use this one now. We'll use that like maybe up here. Let's do that. And then we'll use, thinking of doing, doing like two of the little boxes there. Oh, maybe we'll use this size. Let's, let's do this size here. It's not too bad. Okay. I don't know if I like this washi though. Mm. No. I don't. I don't like the washi. Mm -mm. Nope. Okay. We're not doing that. I don't like that look with the washi, so. The washi's out. It's out. Or wait, let me see. Let's just try the white one. Maybe. Oh no, I just realized that. I'm glad because we have that gold. And that's gold. Mm. <laughs> okay, so let's see. What else? We need some, like, I feel like I need a quote or something. Mm. Okay, let's see what kind of gold quotes we have in this book. <clears throat> that we can bring in to this spread. I may have to bring out the other one instead of this big one. Yeah. Living that happy life. I like that. If I can put that somewhere in here, that's kind of pinkish. But no, let me let me pull that other book, the book with the quotes, essential quotes, the actual classic size one, because then we may have some like smaller ones that we can put in here. Oh, that love today, but then it's a different pink. Every day, everything will be okay. Uh, uh, kind of matches the boxes, so. And I can make like a little cluster with that. Learn and grow. Ooh, we're doing this one. We're using this one. Yep. Okay, so let's keep that open to that page because I want to pull that in. If I put that there, we don't... Oh, no, no, no. Okay, maybe we need to put that here. Learn and grow. 
which I think. I think that's cute, but I need to go. Where's my, where's my, my white out pen? Because I need to get these lines out of here. Here we go. Let's get some of these lines out. Okay, that's almost perfect. Okay, so we're gonna let that try a little bit. And then I think if we want to bring this one in, we can like layer it. Hmm, there's like two quotes there. Maybe I can put it here. But then I want it to bring in like the lighter pink boxes. Hmm. And I don't want to make it too boxy. Okay, let's do this. Let's do that. Then I can bring in some more of these little pink ones. The lighter pink. Let's see. I'm not that same size though. Yeah, let's do this one. Maybe if I put it here, I'll put it here, and then I can put one of those florals over there. Let's see how that's going to look. Okay. Let's use our tape. So I'm, I'm not sure. You guys may be asking, like, when does she even decide when? To use the tape or the pen. I think I mentioned in one of my videos before. Oops. I normally like to use the pen when there's like clear stickers, like for boxes. I don't mind using the tape because I mean it's kind of kind of like blend in anyway. And then with the clear stickers, it's just better to not have that whole line of light out tape on there versus when you have the boxes that makes sense yep okay we can put that down now I like that so now we're going to go in and get a flower to put here I think we're just gonna use this white one. Let's just look, I don't have any of these pink ones, but like I said before, like the pink ones, like they really look nice, but it's like they're paper. But it would be cute to bring that in here. Then I can put another one. The other part of it can go down here somewhere. Bunch of, that's going to be a bunch of cutting, but it'll be nice. Okay, let's see what we can do. So that's taken away from a lot of the flower. Let's not do that. Let's not do that part. Okay, let's try to do. All right, let's see. If I do it over here, then, no. Okay, now I'm all the way over. Should I do the third? Okay, let's try this over here. Let's try it. And I will have, let's 
just do. Hmm. What do I want to do? Here, here. Here. I can do part of it here. Let's do that. Let's do part of it here. Okay, I don't know what just happened with this flower, but I don't know my knife wasn't cutting or what. Maybe this one's not coming up. I don't know. I don't know what is happening with this flower here. I don't know if the paper is thicker or what, but it is not coming. There we go. Okay. Not cooperating. Okay. So, let's go ahead here. What is my exacto? Maybe, maybe I need to change my blade because maybe I'm cutting too light. I don't know what's happening. Okay, let's um, let's put that piece to the side. We can just lift up this box, hopefully, and put that part of the flower under there like that okay that's not what i planned on doing but we are going to roll with it and then i don't know about this piece we're gonna put this piece back and then maybe we can use the other one a part of it over here. Maybe. Let's use let's use the smaller one. Let's do that. And then we can bring in okay, let's do let's do a darker pink of this size. Yes, let's do that. This one here. I can actually put the flower there. Let's do that. Then bring in another small pink one here about this size let's do that there That's 
cute. And then I wanted a dark one over there. Right here. I'll do the really small one. There. This size. Yep. That's cute. It's kind of boxy, but we will go with it. Ooh, I wonder if I can still bring this in somewhere here. Maybe. I think. Let's do this. I'm gonna get this like really, really jagged part there. Let's cut that. I'm gonna put it gonna put it there, and then we'll trim that little piece off that we don't want over the washi, I mean over the box. I think that's going to be nice. Let's see how we're going to do that. So, is that far up enough? Yes. So I want it to come over the box, but then I'm going to take this part off. Uh-oh. I love, like, Transparent. The transparent washi because I can see the boxes through it. It's easier for me to trim around it like that. Yes, I like that look. I like that little effect. And then maybe we can take this one and bring it into the words. I don't know what you're thinking. Mm -mm -mm -mm. No, that's a little too much. Or we could bring it from maybe like here. Ooh, ooh, let's do that. It's a nice little touch. So we need to take some of that off. And then let's see how that looks now. Up against that smaller box. And then, of course, we're going to trim it from around the big box. So, it's like going through it, around it, whatever you want to call it. Yes, I like this look. Okay. So, see how easy it is to trim because you can kind of see through it. So, easy to trim it around the box. I think I want to find, let me just pull my book out. I've taken almost all of the bullet point pages out of like most of my book, sticker books, and put them into this little sticker book. And I think we're going to use, I think I'm going to use this lighter pink. No, I'm going to make sure it matches. Nope. Doesn't match my boxes. Let's try this one. I'll do the lighter pink. Let's see if it matches. Um, that one's kind of close. So let's put this one back. I know the darker ones match the dark boxes, but I don't know. Wait. No, I want to use the light one. Let's do that. Put that one back. And then, yeah, that one's going to be our best, best bet. <sighs> or 
Or I could go with these pink ones in here. I just forgot all about that. I actually have some in here that I could use. Ooh, and then I know it matches. You know what? Okay, let me put this back. We're going to go with the same ones in this um, Mojo Jojo Plans book because we know it's going to match our boxes because that's where we got them from. And we're going to go with that. So, I'm going to pull in some of these little points. I definitely need a maybe one, um, one there for Monday. I got this box for Tuesday. And then... That one is going to go there, so I can't, oh, that didn't work out. That did not work. Okay, so I may need one here. Yeah, there. Then I got some for Wednesday. Wednesday. I want to put it there or over here. Wednesday, I'll need this for Wednesday anyway because my uh, great level meeting is here. So I may have a few tasks to complete on Wednesday. I can put that there. So we'll do two of these on Wednesday. I have that for Thursday and then I need some. Not really for Friday, but. I won't be at work, but I could put like, you know, just a few reminders for myself to have things done before Friday because I will be out. Okay, so we'll put that there. And I think we are done. I think that is going to be it. Let me take one little look at it, see if that's it, if we need to add in anything. Let's see. Let's look at it. No, we're doing it. I think that's it. I like 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 it a lot. So, we're going to go ahead and put our pages back on the disc. I love the way it came out. Super cute. I love that it's like functional. And, of course, it has some florals, which are my all-time favorite. Hopefully, you guys have enjoyed this video, um, enjoyed the walkthrough and talking through of the process if so, make sure to give it a thumbs up. And if you'd like to see more from my channel, make sure that you are subscribed. Do not forget to turn on that notification bell so that you get alerts every time that I post new videos. And until next time, bye love.